Welcome to WXW.com. I'm meteorologist Warren Sears. A pretty chilly 10 degrees for the forecast tonight. Pretty cold, partly cloudy, and we will see a west breeze 5 to 10. So that'll knock our wind chills down anywhere from 5 to 10 degrees below our actual temperatures. So a lot of us will wake up tomorrow morning feeling like the single digits. So we're dry for the morning on Tuesday. Then as we head into the afternoon, that winter storm is going to push in. Now, right now we're going to be on the very northern extent of this winter storm. So I do think that we will stay mostly snowfall here with travel impacts pretty likely, especially to the evening commute. And that snow will last through a good chunk of our Tuesday and then linger eventually early Wednesday morning. Now, as far as totals go, I'm expecting anywhere between three and six inches in the Cooley region with some heavier and higher totals just towards the south down towards Prairie du Chien, Crawford, Richland counties over to Madison, kind of in that southwest Wisconsin, northeastern Iowa and eastern Iowa range. So as the storm develops, we'll continue to track it and we'll update that forecast for you here over the next 24 hours. But again, expect some snow for Tuesday night and travel impacts for sure. 21 for Tuesday night is a low snow continues and again it will taper off early Wednesday morning. Then after that storm system moves through we're left with 28 on Wednesday probably a little bit on the breezy side but we'll be dry for most of the day. Good day to shovel for sure. 26 for Thursday and then 29 for Friday. I have my eyes on the potential for another storm system on Friday. It's too early for more, many details there. We'll have to iron those out. Let's just focus on at least tomorrow for now but we could see some more snow Friday and then heading on into next weekend. Temperatures actually might warm up a little bit to the mid thirties by Monday.